Well, it's a little bit like that game Grover used to play on Sesame Street. But as near as we want to get to the bison here at Elk Island National Park, officials are telling us for our own safety, it's best to remain far away. A bison rut is when uh, is basically the mating season. Love is in the air at Elk Island National Park, but... Bulls are... Uh, being more aggressive this time of year, they're uh, doing dominance displays, uh, trying to impress the females and chase off uh, other males. That aggressive amorous behavior can include bellowing, snorting, charging and head shaking. So visitors are encouraged to stay in their vehicles, drive slowly and quietly observe the animals at roadside turnouts. And if you are getting out to snap pics at one of the lookouts, give the bison a little privacy. So we ask people to stay 100 meters away from bison. We recommend using the rule of thumb, that is putting your thumb up at arm's length. And if your thumb can cover a bison completely, then you're a safe distance. Now, while there have been no reports of serious encounters here, these bison are the same species as those at the Yellowstone National Park in the U.S. That's why this viral video was taken of a nine-year-old girl getting flung into the air after encroaching on the animal's space. Bull bison can get up to 1,000 kilograms, 2,000 pounds, uh, and they can still move very quickly, uh, about 60 kilometers an hour. And it's not just your personal safety at risk when disturbing a herd. When they're experiencing people that get too close, it's, uh, it affects their natural behaviors. It means that they're able to spend less time foraging and they're, they're spending more energy moving away from that discomfort. The rules are in effect through mating season, which runs until September. The payoff for visitors' good behavior? Some cute new park additions come spring. Expect most of the calves to be born in May and June of next year. At Elk Island National Park, Corny Terrio, City News.